I'm excited to share a new project with you today. It's been a while and it is our Arizona homestead house. Today we'll be sharing the exterior, the entry, the great room and the formal dining space. This project is a Rambler style new build and we started from the ground up. Some of the details I really love about this exterior elevation are the dormer windows and the decision to keep those dark. We used bronze windows throughout, but I think when you're choosing the combination of materials on the exterior of your home, sometimes it's hard to know what to use where. And we decided to use a metal roof throughout the entire home, not just on the front porch. And I love that look. We also incorporated the wood on the columns, yes, but also on the little awnings over a few windows. Taking you into the entry space, we have this adorable Dutch door that greets you when you walk in. And the footprint of the entryway is small, but I love that it has this great height. The dormer windows that you saw on the exterior, one of them is in the entryway. And so you look up and then you see that we incorporated beams in this great lantern and we have natural light coming in from up top. We did this oak chest that has some traditional details and incorporated a patterned rug that brings in some rust and blue tones that you'll see carried throughout the other spaces in the home. We have an antique olive jar to add that piece of vintage into the space. In little spots throughout the house, you'll see that we have these landscapes that incorporate the Arizona landscape and just makes it feel more personal. And I love that you know where you are and we have those little moments throughout, but then we have a really big mirror with a leather strap to open up this small space. So walking into the great room, this is a family home. Our clients have young kids and this is the main living area, but they have their like fun TV hangout room in a different space that we'll show you later. So there's no TV. We were able to use this great mirror layered with artwork and really beautiful branches. We used a neutral sofa and we have this sliding door system at the back of the great room. And our client loved the idea of a day bed and we were very for that. So instead of doing a love seat, we did this really deep day bed and I think it's perfect for lounging. We can incorporate lots of pillows and textiles. And then across from that, I love this camel colored velvet and curved edges on furniture are very big right now. And I love that they look good from behind when you walk into the space. And we have this great layered seagrass coffee table that adds some great texture, a rustic console table. I think one of my favorite details, no, easily, this is my favorite detail in this space. Our clients are both doctors and these little spindle chairs at the front of the room are from their alma mater. And I just love that they're so unique to them. They add a richness to the room and personality. In this great room space, we have these beautiful exposed trusses on the ceiling. And I think the natural answer would usually be to leave them a raw wood color but our clients love a light and airy style and we had some wood accents throughout beams in the entry their front door the columns on the front porch and in an effort to keep it light and also not so matchy matchy throughout the home we decided to paint them this really soft warm gray and i love the effect that it has this tonal effect with the walls. And then we tied that color into the built-ins flanking the fireplace. And those built-ins are great. We did these glass doors with a subtle arch on the top and this great cream on bolts that fastens them. Moving into the dining room. Our clients love a light and airy style. You'll see this throughout. We started by doing a paneling in here that was white and about halfway through the build, I was just like, I can't do it. I think that this room needs to be really dark. So 
encouraged our clients and they went for it to go super moody in here. And it had a more square shape. So we went with a big round table, woven chairs with these great custom tufted cushions. And again, another personal detail that I think adds so much to the space is our client had this collection of dishes. And so we integrated this plate rack into the molding and it works a great display. It fills the wall space and is a great complement to these really pretty pressed botanicals on the opposite side. Thanks so much for joining us. We'll have the photo tour on the blog and more webisodes to come.